Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Diamond Painting with Megan. Today I am back and I am ready to do another uh, unboxing. So today I have a Diamond Art Club unboxing and I also have a quick Amazon unboxing that we will do. Um, so let's get into Diamond Art Club first. So today I've got, as you can tell by the pink line, this is going to be a round painting. And on the front it also shows a round uh, emblem to show that it is round. And today we are looking at Manny Manzano's Beauty and the Beast. My three-year-old is here with me again. So let me just get my tweezers here so we can get into this box. Hope you guys are all having a wonderful day. I am excited to do another opening with you. It's been forever. I think it's been like three or four months um, since I've been able to do an unboxing with you. So I'm excited to be back. I have a whole bunch of my stash that I'm ready to unbox with you. All right. So this is also my new light pad. I've got an A3 light pad that I got from Amazon. I will link it in the description below along with this painting from Diamond Art Club. And I will try to link the one from Amazon as well as long as it is still available. So let's pull all of our stuff out from the box. So that's all in the box. All right, so we've got our toolkit, standard toolkit from Diamond Art Club for a round kit. It comes with a, a clear drill tray, a squishy, a blue pen, two heart-shaped wax, and some baggies. Um, they also have been putting four placers in here, but I'm not sure what this one has. Let's see if we can find it here. They've been putting a lot more baggies in there too, and it does. It, it has a, a slim four placer which is my favorite multi-placer right now. So let's just set this stuff off to the side. Uh, also, they've been coming in with these little stickers that I put into my log book to log them. You can also stick them on the end of the box for when you're storing them in a closet or on a shelf to show what's in the box. These are great. I love these stickers from Diamond Art Club. We have our schematic sticker. These are great for labeling your containers because you can just cut out all of the symbols and stick them right straight onto your containers. And there is the picture for it. It is so beautiful. I have been addicted to Manny Manzano lately, so these are amazing. This one has 38 colors and it looks like it's got one AB in it, yes. which is going to be yes. uh, number 130, yes. which is going to be a yellow. Yes. And we'll get into that when we look at our drills. So this painting, sorry, I totally forgot this information. Uh, so this is a 42 by 59 centimeter round. Oh, look at that, you guys. Oh, it's beautiful. So it's not overly big, which is nice because all of the ones that I've gotten lately have been really big. Uh, you get a starter tips and tricks book. It's got a code for 10% off in it. We've got our drills and we've got our canvas. So here's our canvas. I'm gonna try to do this. I'm working with a little bit of space today. But there is our canvas, isn't it beautiful? The colors are amazing. So Diamond Art Club's canvases are made of tarpaulin. So it is very, very soft on the bottom. It's got serge edges so it doesn't fray. And it's a very sparkly canvas, which helps make the colors pop, which is really important on round drills because you've got that color showing through in between the drills. So Mommy. we've got Cinderella, or sorry, Beauty. We've got Belle um, coming down with her beautiful, beautiful dress. And then this gorgeous background. I love Mandy Manzano and her stained glass styles. And some of the older paintings that they don't have the faces on them. All right, so let's get into the drills. If you don't like the sound of the crinkling bags, please fast forward through this. But here we go. And I do store my drills separate from my canvases. 
so I have a um, three, a trifold board that I put all of my smaller canvases in and then all of my bigger canvases hang. And so I'll put the schematic sticker in with the drills and then I store them separately. All right, so let's take a look at our drills here. So we've got two strands of drills. So we've got 3756, 3865, 718, which is a beautiful, beautiful pink. We've got 445, 340, 776, 3846, and I'm reading these backwards, so if I get any of the numbers wrong, I apologize. Uh, 838, 3823, which is a really pretty, like, light, light yellow. Uh, 3607, 3746, 598, 996, 938, 3811, 400, up. 130, there's our AB. It's a gorgeous, gorgeous, like lime, lemon yellow lime. I am not quite awake yet here, you guys. We've got 782, 992, which is a beautiful teal color, and 939, which is a dark blue, almost black. We've got 3371. 803, 3814, 798, 312, 3837, 550. Those two purples are gorgeous. Uh, 823, 327, 972, which in the camera looks yellow, but it's actually orange. 740. 814, two bags of that. 890. 741. Again, it looks yellow, but it's actually orange. Uh, 947. And then we've got 310. We've got two bags of 310, so not too terrible for 310, especially with Amanda Manzano. We've got 815 and 900, and that's a really full bag of 900. Okay. All right, I'm gonna put these back in their bags and I'll be right back. All right, so now that we have our drills back in our bag, um, they do have a sticker on the bag that says which painting it's for, but I just slide my schematic into the bag. Just like so. That way it's all tucked in safe. I don't have to worry about losing it. And then I'll just close that up and it's ready to go into my storage bin. All right, so let's see where, and I'm gonna leave the painting sideways, but I'll push around so we're up here. Um, so let's see where our, our ABs go. So they are number one. So there's gonna be some up here in this little bit of background right here. There's some sprinkled out throughout her hair, all throughout her dress. Basically, anywhere that you see um, the, the bright yellow, there's going to be one. So it's all sprinkled throughout this upper part of her dress. And then that looks about it. So this upper part of her dress, her hair, and this little bit of background right here. Sorry about that. I went to zoom in and I hit the button. All right, so as you can see, Diamond Art Club has a very, very clear drill filled. And you're gonna see that that uh, number one symbol right there is gonna be where our ABs go. So very clear symbols, very bright colors. It's it's gonna be beautiful worked up. I did Alice, or I did um, Wonderland, which is the same style, and it turned out Daddy, amazing. Daddy. I know the baby's crying because she needs to go nine night. All right, so let's go ahead and set this aside and I'll pull out our Amazon painting. Uh, that one I will list below what the price is because I don't remember right offhand what the price was for that one. I do believe it was $39.99, um, but I will list it below with the description. All right, so this came from Amazon. And 
this one with all of the stuff that I've been going through right now with my bipolar and my anxiety and my depression, I just felt that this was, this was very fitting for the times that I was going through. So we've got a few bags of girls. So it says, love myself, and it's got butterflies all over it. So the only thing I'm seeing with this, okay, please stop. The only thing that I'm seeing with this is the background, which is all number threes, is a little bit hard to read, but with my light pad, um, I'll zoom you in. With my light pad, uh, I don't think I'm going to have an issue seeing it. The only one that I am seeing issues with here is this, this dark blue right here. I cannot see the symbol, but it, from looking at the schematic over here, um, it looks like it's going to be an M because the symbol that's on the schematic actually matches that it's, it's very hard to read, but it matches on the canvas. So from there, I'll be able to, to tell and differentiate what it is. But for the most part, the symbols are clear. It did come folded just in half, which is kind of nice because there is um, nothing wrong with the canvas besides this one fold in the middle, which is super easy to get out and flatten out. Zoom you back out here. So yeah, just that one fold from it being folded in half, but that won't take anything to flatten out. It is poured blue. And it is, it is very, very sticky. So that's good quality. I did buy this one off of Amazon. I do believe it was like $3.99 or $4.49. Again, I will list the prices with the, de the description and the link down in the description box below. So let's go through the drills for this one. So you've got your, your standard tray. Uh, Miss, Co Miss Coffee calls them pumpkin spice drill kit, um, tool kit, sorry, pumpkin spice tool kit. So you get uh, one green boat, a couple, I think there's like three baggies in there, a little small piece of wax and your basic drill kit. And the drills are kind of taped together. There is it looks like 20 colors on this one and it is a 30 by 40. So this is a good snack size. Um, they do not have uh, DMC codes on the bags, but the DMC codes are on the um, canvas. So on here, I'm just trying to figure out 080601. I'm not sure what that number is. 601080603. So some of these have 601 on them and some of them have 0, uh, 080603. Kind of down below, and it's uh, B2538 16. I don't know if these are using the right drills for this. Oh, they are. So Fifty two eighty three is the canvas number, which is listed first. Zoom me in again. Sorry about my hand. Um, so on the drills, they've got the B two five two, or sorry, B two five eight three. That's the canvas number, and then this this number following it is the number that matches on the canvas. I don't know what this bottom number is, but from there you can match it up for the DMC numbers. Um, little kits like this, I don't tend to keep it, but 
Uh, so we've got four bags, four bags, five bags, because there's one kind of randomly in here of number three. So we've got five bags of 310. And the drill quality um, actually looks pretty good. There's a couple dimples that I see in the bottom of the drill, but other than that, they look pretty clean. Doesn't look static. They, they're not staticky. They don't look dirty. They don't look oily. Um, and I don't see any trash from right off the hand. So since these don't have DMC numbers on them, I'll just kind of scroll through and let you see the colors. So actually let's flip them over so you can see the colors from the back side. They are very sparkly. So this will be a quick project, just a quick workup. And like I said, I feel like it it really suits my mood that I've been going in lately. And here's all of our our little amounts here. Beautiful reds, and pinks, and purples for the butterflies. So yeah, 20 colors, so it'll be a quick workup. Um, most of it's color blocking because of the, the back side. And I got a new tripod, so I'm still trying to get used to the, the angle that I'm working at. Um, so it's kind of weird and a little bit harder. But yeah, so most of it's going to be color blocking. Um, if I have any extra uh, um, ABs, I may throw some ABs in there. Or I may go get some because Joann's, being that this is a round kit, Joann sells diamond dots and they sell separate colors. So I may go get some just to add a little bit of extra sparkle into these. So again, I will link this one below with the price. And I... Uh, I will let you know if it is available or not, but that's all I have for you today. I will be back in a couple days with another Diamond Art Club unboxing, but until then, make sure you wash your hands, stay safe, stay healthy, wear your mask, keep your distance. We'll get through this. We will make it through this, but until next time, I'll see you guys later. Bye. Bye.